got a quick video I want to give you guys about uh, how much I like this TST uh, tire pressure system. I have a tire pressure sensor on every one of my tires, all 18. I started with the eight in the back on the trailer and I love the system so much that I uh, got some more for the front, uh, for, for, the, for the tractor. All, all eight tires plus my two uh, steer tires, which makes 10. 18 sensors in total. Let me show you the uh, device here and give you some reasons why I really like the uh, TST tire pressure system for my truck and trailer. Let me show you one reason why I really love TST tire pressure system. You see, I got sensors on all of my tires, all 18. So right now we're looking at the front left steer tire. Now we're looking at the drive tire on this side. Um, you can program so many different like uh, parameters and settings. And as you can see, all my tires are within three PSI of each other. The ones that are right next to each other, that's 99, that's 100. That's 99, 98, 98, 99, 99, 97, and so on. So one thing this really gives you an edge on is making sure that your tires are close to each other in tire pressure. Because if you have two tires that are next to each other that are more than five pounds of pressure difference, you can easily start to wear a tread pattern uh, in your tire and once that tread pattern starts it's almost impossible to stop it so by keeping your tires that close within three to five pounds of pressure uh, for the two tires that are right next to each other as long as you keep it in that range you are seriously doing yourself a favor by prolonging the life of your tire so not only are we prolonging the life of our tire by using TST tire pressure uh, system we are also catching the tire pressure differences when it comes to weather uh, there's about two times a year where I have to either take air out or add air in. So the winter is a time when, say, if you have your drive tire set at 100 PSI, when winter really sets in, the temperature is going to be lower and you're going to lose air pressure instead of 100 PSI might be down all the way to 90. And if you're not vigilant and if you're not checking your tire pressures all the time, you maybe you won't catch this and then you start to wear your tires out or pop a tire or blow a tire. So when winter comes out, put pressure back in the tires. Then when summer comes, now my 100 will probably be more like 110. And you definitely don't want to ride around with 110 in your tires. Then after they heat up even more, they'll expand and there's a good uh, chance of blowing a tire. So you got the re reducing risk uh, when it comes to creating irregular tread wear. You can catch temperature changes. And another thing I really like too is you can catch slow leaks. So while you're watching this going up and down the road, or maybe overnight you check your sensors real quick, you might have lost 10 pounds of pressure. But if you were walking around your truck and you, if you were just kicking tires or hitting it with a tire hammer, you probably wouldn't have caught, you, you probably wouldn't catch it that it's 10, 10 pounds low. Um, so I've caught a couple slow leaks like that where I have like a nail and it's leaking really slow. And I was able to catch it because of this system. And another thing that, uh, that's really cool is say if you're driving on the road and you feel like you drove over something that was sketchy and you're concerned about your tire well now you don't really have to stop uh at least you know that's my opinion you don't really have to stop because you can just check this and if you have a fast leak it's going to alert you right away and you can just go to that tire that you think you might have hit and you'll see that hey it's fine or hey yeah you do uh it does need some attention I really love this. Um, I've had this system installed for over two years now. Actually, probably close to three years now. The sensors still do good. This uh, unit holds its charge really good. Uh, it communicates with the back tires fine. It keeps me really, really uh, on point with my tire pressures. And it's so convenient because it's just sitting right here on my dashboard next to my GPS. So at any given moment, I can look at my tire pressure. And let's face it. Uh, see, look at that. What's that? Let me go back. 96, 99. Yeah, see that 96 does need a little bit more air, but see, it's still within three pounds of, uh, of the tire next to it. But, um, the system works great. Like I said, the sensors have lasted a long time. Oh, that's what I was saying is this that, I mean, let's just be honest. Let's be real. I mean, how many truck drivers really get out there with the tire, uh, with the tire gauge and check every tire every day? As long as I've been out here 10 years now, I've never, I don't think I've ever really seen anybody go out and check every tire with their uh, tire pressure gauge. So this is so much better than 
um, hitting it with a tire thumper and stuff like that because you're not going to catch when it's 10 pounds low. You're not going to catch when it's over five pounds in difference. Uh, then you'll start to wear out your tires. Like the set of Michelin tires that I've had on the truck now, I've had them for almost five years now. And I still got plenty of tread. And this is a big reason of why my tires last so long because I'm so on point with my tire pressure system. So you guys definitely consider picking up this TST. See the brand T. Oh, it's hard to see. Let me turn my light on. You see the brand TST. Uh, they're based in North Atlanta, North Georgia. And this whole system will probably run you about, geez, I forget how much I paid, probably about five to $800. Sounds like a lot of money, but this is going to save you so much time and it's going to save you money on tires in the long run. I mean, even just catching one slow leak before you blow a tire, you just save three to $500 on a tire. Or if you catch your steer tires, if there are two tires that are not the same pressure, over five pounds difference, and you catch it before it makes an irregular wear, that's another tire that you just saved. And if you're buying Michelin, just $500 tire you just saved. So do yourself a favor and invest into your business with TST. I definitely recommend TST. This is Andrew's method, and you know I don't recommend things that I don't use. I uh, really, 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 really like this product. Y'all should go check them out. Tell them that I sent you. Andrew's method. Catch you on the next one.